Sophia Popov, a six and five winner today over Sun Hyung Park. Sophia, you never never trailed today. Pretty dominant. Take us through uh, what it was like to put together that performance. Uh, yeah, today was was very solid uh, right off the bat. Um, I just. Uh, you know, I, I won the first hole and I kind of never looked back. Uh, my ball striking was was very good today. Uh, I putted well. I made all the putts that I had to make and uh, definitely made a few more birdies than yesterday, so that helped. Group 15 winner. Obviously, business still to to go, but to come out of group group stage has to be a, somewhat of a win. Yeah, definitely. I think uh, you know that's the first goal. The first goal is to make it out of the group phase and um, you know make it to the weekend and. Uh, I got, I took care of business in that way, and um, definitely am now looking forward to uh, what's next. Yeah. I heard you talking a little bit back here, but can you talk about Shadow Creek as a venue and match play as a format? How excited you are to be at both? Yeah. Um, obviously, Shadow Creek's an incredible place. Uh, I, I watched the guys play here um, end of last year, and. Uh, it's it's amazing. You don't really feel like you're in Vegas. Uh, it's you don't have a deserty feel. It's very green, uh, just really cool golf holes. And I think it suits match play exceptionally well because you just um, you know you never you never know like anything can happen at any point just because the greens are so firm. Uh, you need to hit the right spots on the greens. You need to miss the greens on the right sides. Uh, so I just think it makes it very very interesting for especially for match play and i was wondering if you could think back memorial day weekend a year ago what you were doing and and where you were and how your life has just completely changed over this past year you know i can't can't remember where i was memorial day uh weekend last year but um it definitely has been you know, a crazy roller coaster since then. Obviously, I won the British uh, shortly after, and uh, never knew it was gonna, you know, come my way. The end of the last year and and the beginning of this year, and it's just been, um, you know, exciting for me. I've just been playing good golf since then, and um, you know, really, really can't remember where I was that day, but <laughs> but, but it's been quite nice since then. <laughs> yeah. Do you feel comfortable out here now? Do you feel like this is your home and this is where you? belong yeah absolutely you know I, I kind of felt that uh, previously even to winning the British but I think it was always tough because it was such such an up and down and I'd get into events I wouldn't get into events and uh, you know back and forth I'd go back to Q school and uh, I think now I've just finally settled and um, I feel comfortable I feel like I can uh, just go out and have a good time and and really enjoy it and take everything in knowing you know Every round, every round that I play now, it's not going to determine what happens the rest of the year or next year. So um, that's a really nice feeling to have. And then have a good time. Can you have a good time playing NB tomorrow? Or <laughs> yeah, uh, you know I think I can have a good time playing NB tomorrow. Um, I think she's she's obviously a really good player, but I've played with her a lot over the last few months, and um, maybe got to get uh, I got to know her game fairly well. So. You know, it's it's match play. Anything can happen, and um, I've been striking it really solid the last two days. So I just kind of have to keep doing what I'm doing. I can only I can only uh, focus on my own game. How? And, the, and then if you if you do, assuming you can beat NB, don't want to get ahead of yourself. But is that? Do you feel like there might be a letdown because that's going to be the best player you'll see probably, or is this just match play and you just got to take it a whole at a time? It's just match play. You take it one match at a time and. Honestly, every player here can can win this tournament at the end of the at the end of the week. So just take it match by match and player by player. Thank you. It looks like not official yet, but NB looks like your opponent. Um, you've played with her a lot this year. I'm trying to remember exactly when. Can you can you recall? Yeah. So I played with her in Singapore. That's the most recent uh, time we played together. Uh, after the first, I think two days. So on the third day we played together, uh, as well as at Kia in the mm -hmm. third round. So. Uh, yeah, I, I played with her a, f a couple times, maybe two or even three times this year. Um, but yeah, it's uh, more more than ever before. <laughs> <laughs> Have you learned anything from her or learned anything about yourself playing with her? Yeah, you know, I think every time that I play with her, uh, I'm starting to get more comfortable and uh, 
managed to play my own game. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's very tough. She's very solid. She, she's someone who doesn't make a lot of mistakes, and she's just probably the most even-keeled player out here emotionally. Um, so a lot of things that I look up to and, and that I would love to, you know, do myself, I guess, or, or be able to replicate. Um, but at the same time, you know, I, I kind of know what my strengths are and I know uh, the part of the game that I can, I can possibly beat her in. I think it's a little more humid out here today than in days past and obviously warmer over the weekend. Temps nearing triple digits. How does Sophia pop off with the potential for two matches each day? Stay hydrated and rested. Uh, you know, I feel like uh, in Singapore and Thailand, I got a good feel for playing in the heat and the humidity and uh, hydration is important. Um, I drink a lot of water. I drink uh, a lot of, you know, I take a lot of electrolytes and, uh, and try to eat even though it's so hot and you're not hungry, you know, you got to snack every couple of holes and uh, just to make sure you stay focused and, and your, your brain's functioning properly. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, it's definitely something that my caddy's on top of, and I'm on top of his hydration. So, uh, so something we, I guess, feed off of each other. Yeah, looking out for each other. Thanks, Sophia. Thank you.